All right, so back to this continuing carrying on. Again, you know, what I might do is I might try to finish this before I should be leaving Friday. Granted, I'll only be gone for like the weekend, but still, you know, I'm not going to be able to record. So what I might do is I might try to push. I can get two recordings done today and two done tomorrow. I guess it's a question of is four going to be enough to get to the end of this, right? I think, um, again, you know, who knows? What we do know is, again, this mod, we, we confirmed it, right? This mod has taken a completely different direction from the original, uh, even more so than Exit Music, right? You know, Exit Music, the Redux, you know. Again, you know, that one was like, and I originally thought it was the inverse. I'm like, oh, this is just going to be more of an aesthetic, right, remake. But again, you know, <clears throat> with uh versus like exit music where they again they changed it due to copyright but we noticed they changed a bit of the storyline right but this you know it's completely changed right like again the whole car crash premise just didn't happen and it's quite possible the whole choice of monica offing herself is also not going to happen because it seems like a, the kind of main plot point or the the force forcing function here is again the whole reset right I'm very curious if they're even going to have it to where I, I feel if because, again, in the original, she, you know, tells everyone about the state of their reality. Right. You know, that's that's kind of a main main plot point. Right. You know. And then you have to decide whether to forgive her for her actions in this. Who knows if that's even the case? My uh, my sneaking suspicion is that it is and it'll remain the same. But again, who knows? Right. Uh, it's quite possible that it could be different. Um, again, you know, it's something to where it's like, I think the uh, main thing there with that is that, uh, yeah, you know, but that'd be like an end game. So we, we need to get to that again, you know. Yeah, and where we left off, right, is, uh, again, the MC and C are in the club after, um, again, after their argument, right, and kind of coming off of that, you know, so... Let's see. Who's who's uh speaking? Is this the MC? You know. Oh yeah, this is uh because they're reading, you know, Truman's uh show, right? Damn the fifth chip. Bitch, you were supposed to read like two or three. I, I even remember that, you know. And again, I'm like, what the hell is the MC even listening to, you know? Yeah, you know, it's like, I, and funny enough, they, at least Monica knows, right, you know, that they both want to work through it, but it's just about them being able to convince the other, right, you know, and again, you know, uh, being able to remedy that, you know. Because again, you know, so funny enough, completely off topic, there was this old, actually, like, let me look him up now. There was this old YouTuber I used to watch. He was this, uh, he played uh, Call of Duty, Black Ops, like, 2, right? His name was Drifter, right? And it's a zero, I think, for, yeah, you know, yeah, Drifter with the zero, you know. Is he still make videos? He still does make videos, right? So... Yeah, so this dude, right? And again, this dude, he still has the fucking yin yang profile picture. Because it's been like years since I've looked into this guy. But I remember watching his old, um, again, and it, he still gets a decent, I guess, a decent following, right? He has over a million subscribers. So it's like, you know, but I used to watch him. And I remember um, watching a video where, and I mean, like you know i guess it, it's a public it was a public video right because otherwise how would i know right you know but he he talked about like uh i think he he talked about like a like suicide attempt he had right and talked like through it just vaguely what i can remember it was a hanging one too either that or i'm completely making it up either i'm like delusional and like imagining things or that was a public video right it's one of the two and and either you know I'm right in one aspect or I'm just speaking complete nonsense the other. So it doesn't really matter, right? But, you know, it's like. 
and that was again but like how how do you like you know work through something like that live through something like that right you know obviously i've never attempted suicide debatably uh i don't want to go to an extent and say i've had suicidal thoughts but i have definitely had like rougher periods in life again most of the like i guess death that i've been you know exposed to has been like others right you know um like family friends like it, it, it's not the same as you know oneself right so it's like you know how and especially like i talk about like the people who jump off like the uh whatever bridge it's the golden gate right you know some of the survivors right it's like you know again how how is that like and, and a lot of people they also try to like od on something right and they end up surviving but it's like so it's not just obviously the mc same and sayori but like in real life you know if you if you because like it's like how do you prevent relapsing and just killing yourself again right or at least attempting to right you know it's like it's not as simple as going back to an addiction. Like, you know, if you try to kill yourself once, you know, and for whatever reason it doesn't go through, right? How do you prevent yourself from ending up in a mind space or head space to where you, again, continue where you do it again, right? Again, so, what was it? Wasn't it um Stalin Shun who, like, shot himself? He survived and then it, Stalin just berated him? I might be making that up. But, again, you know, but it's like, and yeah, you know, and the MC, I mean, to be fair, yeah, that was like something that came out of nowhere with Yuri's ship, right? So, again, but yeah, it's just about, you know, moving forward, right? Again, but that doesn't matter, right? Because you're not going to be able to understand her and her mentality, you know, you just got to be there, right? You know, and at, like validate that. So, yeah, you know. He's like, I'm gonna be honest. I was, I didn't read anything, you know. Be better told, my dude. Can I swear to God, her and Yuri like need to like stop like inserting whatever like genre or like medium media like every into every single fucking sentence they say, you know. The hint of mystery, and again, we we know. I know. I finished reading five chapters before everyone else. Nobody, damn, you know. Good, good for you, you know, uh, Jesus. But I was going to say, you know, again, it, it parallels the mirrors Monica's situation, right? But let's see. Yeah, she just goes. Yeah, the MC's like, is that just like your, your, what you do now? Like the grocery store, she ain't got money. Like, you know, damn fat ass, you know. Uh, you know, and well, because what here, here, and it makes sense because again, you know, the MC, these were the two that he told, right? Obviously, Natsuki is, you know, like not, he didn't tell Natsuki, which was a good thing, right? You know, Natsuki being from Sayori's angle kind of makes better, more sense, right? But obviously, these two, you know, the MC, you know, yeah, again, so yeah, you know, and, and they're like, damn, I didn't know they knew, right? So yeah, he's like, yeah, my bad, you know. Oh, yeah, again, you know, and because uh, this goes back to, like, you know, again, right? So what am I missing here? Because um, Yuri doesn't – well, wait, what? Hold on. I think she feels just as horrible as you do about everything. And, again, he's – so because Yuri knows about the pills. The MC um, told her that. She even knows about the MC's feelings. So what is being talking about here that she's not aware of? Oh, yeah, you know, Monica's – I forgot that that happened, you know. Yeah, I mean, that makes sense, you know. But again, it's the same way, right? You know. Yeah, again, it's like they just like, it's like, oh, there's point of no return, right? And again, he still blames himself, right? Like, it's just, it's hard for him to not blame himself, just as it's hard for Sayori not to think, you know, they each blame themselves, right? You know, 
And again, funny enough that Monica's saying that, right? She because she blames herself again for very different reasons, you know, but she feels the blame there, right? You know. Yeah, again, she can't even look at him, right? Yeah, you know, and that's referring to because the MC obviously he doesn't know the true extent, but he just knows that Monica and Sayori kind of had a little falling out, you know, prior to his entry into the club. And that, you know, that was kind of the same with it was really just Mock and everyone because she kind of changed as a person. Right. You know. Yeah, again, you know, she and that's why because she was like she was worried that Sayori told him like verbatim what she said, where it's like, oh, you know, maybe like it's it's the right decision to kill yourself. Right. You know, and again, but she just kind of, you know, he he came to that conclusion on his own. Right. see yeah to be fair like yeah fucking dude like literally was like failing all his classes like I mean, yeah shit who knows right that'll be to, to figure out for tomorrow right And again, the MC find out both of them know about Yuri's issue, right? So, yeah, I mean, because like he was worried that, well, again, you know, she thought it was the point of no return, but he kind of felt the same way. But again, you know, that's not exactly what they want, right? Yeah, I mean, you know, it's better that they get this day, right? You know, kind of give them some, uh, you know, just some uh, time to themselves, right? Are we going to get, um, the fuck did he do? You know, what, I was about to say, like, what was, oh, he's doing his homework, right? Oh, she's texting him. Damn, they still, oh, 925. Damn, yeah, this is literally back in uh, October, right? I guess, you know, he's, uh, yeah, you know, coming over, right? Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's like. He's like, damn, oh, fat ass, you know. What? I've never once heard of that. Like, is that a, there's no way that's a thing. How is that, where'd that even come from? Like, you mean when it's like piping fucking hot? Like. Yeah, you know, like. Because, yeah, they, they did, and presumably, you know, the uh, they got the food or, like, the uh, ingredients for the brownies, right? I mean, I get he's making small talk, right? You know, but, like, I feel like there's an obvious answer. Grant, his ass is still going to make it from the box anyway because it's just more convenient, you know? Damn, I was completely... All right. I was completely fucking wrong, you know. Oh, that true, right, you know. Yeah, and again, you know, that's a, like kind of a valid point. Like, shit, yeah, no way he's going to like. Baker Puritan, you know, to bake something and yeah, you know, versus like some like freaking a uh, snobby like. I got bitch fucking interview. What the hell? You know. Let's see. All right. You know. 
rushed. I mean, yeah, she was basically just became a member, you know. Yeah, and again, but and this goes back to like the original. Granted, you know, she knew the four members because they were just like, yeah, the ones who are written into the game script. But again, you know, right again, from their perspective, it kind of goes back to the festival where she was like recruiting. So, you know, that was kind of like the uh, the change there. So. Yeah, you know, yeah, the debate club just, you know. Damn, you know, like just canceled, you know. Yeah, you know. And he's like, damn, you know, my bad, bro. Like, yeah, you know, so like obviously like, and that would have been just like if Monk had never gained sentience, you know. That's just kind of simply, you know, the, like this is obviously, they don't know that, right? But this, that's the scenario that this would end up being, you know. Yeah, you know, she's like, damn, you know. The donut? What? That better not be a fucking JoJo's reference. Is this about to be a JoJo's reference? I was going to say, what the fuck? Like, what are you talking about? Let's see. Hold on, I didn't read that shit at all. To be a little too pushy, you know. Yeah, that was kind of crazy. Say so you were just like pulling Natsuki out of the closet, you know. Hey, good for them, you know. Damn, you know. Hold on, I didn't read this shit at all. You know, yeah, and it's like, yeah, it's the same thing, you know. Yeah, and again, it was Natsuki's idea, right? Yeah, you know, she's just like, damn, now we're 100%, you know, bringing it over, right? Yeah, you know. Yeah, I mean, because, like, the, the reality is they haven't seen each other for however long, you know. Goofy ass dude. This is literally like harmless lies ass fucking technique where it's like you you just like freaking like memory wipe. Like what the hell, you know? It's good for them though. Like. Yeah, you know, that makes sense, right? So, because I think that was kind of the issue. The MC wants, like, you know, he, he just wanted to resolve things like this, right? But it's like, you know, it takes time, right? Yeah, it was a good thing, you know. I was like, damn, got to go to sleep, you know. Oh, I didn't realize I could skip that transition. What theme is this? Full nine hours of sleep, you know. That's literally what he just thought of, you know. It's like, ah, uh, you know. I mean, I guess, you know, a little bit of self-awareness uh, there, right? So... 
see. Friggin' doom scrolling, you know. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, you know. As you say, go on IG Reels, you know. Damn, what the fuck? Main punchline is a man wearing t shirt. Damn, yeah, bell time. It's like, I'm, I'm going to just fall asleep, you know. Yeah, MC, like, failing his... He's like, he's, like, he's going to be a repeat year. You know, Jesus Christ. So. Damn, still looks... It's like, hey, uh, you know, this... Damn, what the fuck, you know? It's like, uh, what? Damn. 15 seconds ago? Yeah, freaking uh, telepathy, you know. Damn, what the fuck? She's like, I'm really not, you know. Oh, yeah, it's the group session, right? So. Yeah, it does make, you know. Yeah, that makes sense, you know. Damn, what the fuck? Bro, the tissue, all right, the tissue box is kind of crazy, you know. Let's see. It's like, well, fucking, you know. It's like, it's like, well. It all started when I was born. Gives like the entire backstory, you know. Yeah, and again, you know. And yeah, well, I'm I'm curious, like I'm curious how this like the direction. Honestly, 50-50 chance this like blows up in an argument. I hate to say it. 50-50 chance this thing like blows up in an argument. Honestly, I'm curious. I think, you know, if there's going to be a weak link, it's probably going to be Monica. Because I think she's going to see everyone, like, working through their issues, right? And, like, again, not be able to handle kind of obviously, again, you know, you got the reset. You got everything that's they're talking about. You got our past actions, right? You know, I, I think she'll probably be the weak link in this conversation. And I'm kind of curious where that's going to, like, lead to or kind of entail, right? You know, yeah, and again, you know, they they spent that time, you know, yeah, going back to that night, right. Yeah, they're all supportive of her, right? Even though Monica knows, you know, she had a hand in that. Let's see. He's like, what the fuck? You know? Yeah, you know. Damn, what the hell? Yeah. Hey, that's good for them, you know. I think what I'm curious is Yuri going to bring up, you know, her cutting, right? I think that's a, a, an interesting question. Natsuki, not seemingly her home life is not really a part of this. But again, we already had in the MC as well as Monica are already aware of uh, Yuri's issues, right? So. Yeah, that's why it's like, again, you know. And then we know, because yeah, that's what like the MC is wondering, like, and then Yuri's kind of making a reference to that, right?
Yeah, and she's kind of being vague here, right? But, you know, kind of also, like, implying, like, you know, nonetheless, right? Yeah, and again, also, like, yeah, because obviously this isn't even going back to, like, Act 1. This is, like, at the start of the mod, you know, where Monica kind of had that falling out with Yuri, right? And this was when the MC kind of came in. That was when he discovered her, um, uh, again, her, like, habit, you know? Yeah, and again, she's, like, kind of, because funny enough, you know, despite, like, how much, like, they're supporting her, right, the, the reality is she's different, right? They're they're never, unless, like, she can make them go through that same experience or epiphany she had, they'll never, you know, because that's just, like, a fundamental different part of, you know, reality, right? So it's, like, Again, you know, and it's awkward because, like, I mean, this is a group therapy session, but at the end of the day, like, no one's going to be able to, like, I guess, relate to her in that sense, you know. Damn, so what, so I'm very, you know, never be able to explain, you know, yeah, and she just kind of puts it down, right, so, yeah, you know. Yeah, basically saying that she'll never, like, because I think that, that everyone wants everyone to talk about, I mean, that's the point of it, right? But she just can't, right, you know? Yeah, you know. Yeah, she waves her feet, so she probably pulled up the console, you know. Yeah, like, bro literally nearly didn't fucking graduate, right? Like, damn what the fuck like all right dude no need to fucking roast the guy like jesus fucking christ like you know yeah but at least you know he's being honest like yeah damn i'm just like low-key kind of lazy as shit like yeah and again because funny enough she was probably telling the truth there right you know Yeah, but I mean, it's a good thing, productive thing, right? Yeah, hey, good, good for them, you know. Grilled cheese, what the fuck, you know? Oh, yeah, it's like, you know, my bad. Damn, yeah, I was making grilled cheese. Hey, invite me over, like. I'm curious if they're ever going to reveal their feelings for an R, though, right? 39%, nearly a 50. I think that's an R big thing, right? She's like, damn, what the fuck's going on? Why am I in the club room? Bitch, I can't read this shit. Love you. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Sayori, who knows? Damn, what the hell? And in through the door walks Wallace, you know. 
maybe I'm reading into it a little too much, but she seemed a little bit downcast today. So, and again, is this like her in the past or something? Because I think that's what, you know, warm, damn, what the fuck? All right. I was going to say, because this was, um, I think this was, uh, who is this in reference to? I think this is MC and Sayori in Act 1, right? Because, again, I think this is the MC talking to Monica, right? You know, and that's when Monica goes, talks to Sayori and basically tells her to off herself, right? You know, that's at that, that point in Act 1, right? You know, I kind of pin, put the nail on the head, you know? Oh, she's actually bleeding, you know? Yeah, that's why I'm like, again, you know, it's Act 1 Monica, right? You know? Dude, this is literally the fucking scene in Interstellar. This is literally the fucking scene from Interstellar. Where it's like, you know, this is literally that fucking scene in Interstellar. Where it's like, the dude is passed up, like, telling himself not to. This is literally that fucking scene, you know? I mean, I'm also friends with her, you know. Yeah, it's like, you know, yeah, just straight up lied, you know. What changed? What happened, you know? Yeah, you know. Because this is a, a scene we get in rain clouds, right? So I'm curious, because again, you know, this scene happened in rain clouds. But I'm curious as to what, because again, you know, we just know that basically Monica tore to off stuff, but we don't know anything more specific. But we're going to get like this mod's version of that, right? Yeah, you know, and she's kind of coming up with some, you know, damn, you know, wait, all right, I'm, because I, I, if I don't, I, I honestly thought she tore to kill herself, right? Like, I think that was the rain clouds and interpretation though, right? You know, because again, that was like Monica was using like the glitch effect, but I guess, you know, um, this is like, uh, I guess, you know, more of a realistic, uh, Damn, you know. Yeah, because like, she's which, and again, this is what that conversation, you know, is what kind of caused her falling out with Sayori, right? You know, DMC, again, completely unaware of what actually, what she said, what happened. You know, another awkward pause, you know. Oh, all right. He's got his eyes on. Oops. Yeah, literally like oopsie. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh shit. He's got his eyes on Natsuki. Oops. Uh, I shouldn't have said that. You know. Yeah, I mean, and then that basically goes to Act 3, Monica, right? You know, obviously, you know, play MAS, right? But, like, the, the original Act 3, right? I mean, she's just sitting there in a room, right? With literally, like, nothing else. Like, I mean, was it worth? Who knows, right? Like, I guess she's reliving through this moment, right? Yeah, I'll skip that. Oh, you know, Truman's uh, detailed derailment. You know, funny enough, again, in the, the parallel, right? You know. What the fuck? Oh, brother, you know. Oh, Jesus Christ. Shut the 
Fuck off. Shut the fuck up. I'm not going to lie. I absolutely despise the isekai like, genre, and I'm not the only one who does, right? I, in like, that's like me also saying, because I guess funny, right? You know, well, I, I the reason why I, I despise the iseki drama, because I just don't, I think it's a cheap cop out for like actual like story and character development. I think it's a lot easier to say like, oh, you have this dude he's in another life, right? You know, versus like actually building a story around like a world, you know, and people who fit in it. Like, again, especially when you get tropes like, oh, the guy who got Sekied is like literally overpowered or like has a whole like harem, you know, fleet of, uh, you know, uh, like dames waiting for him, right? It's like, ah, right, you know, like, again, I I'm just... Like, I, I dog Slice of Life, too. You know, I, I think generally, you know, it's all just, like, the same, right, you know? But, like, I, I really don't, like, you know, but obviously I still watch it, right? Like, look at my playlist, right? But Iseki, you will never catch me watching an Iseki because it's just, I just don't understand why, like, what's the value or appeal of, again, watching a story about, like, let's say, you know, that trades character development, you know, in, in story, right? For just, oh, transporting it in our world. And then the, the story is about, oh, how does this guy like live? Versus like, okay, what if we actually got like an interesting story, interesting premise, you know, with like characters that have development through that world, right? Versus like, oh yeah, uh, average office worker is now in like a medieval setting and has like a whole harem of women and is super overpowered. Like, again, like I'm, you will never catch me watching Isekai, right? You know? Yeah, literally, nobody's fucking watching that shit. Like, I'm not reading that, you know. No, it sounds horrible. I'm not even gonna lie. You know, teenage girl, you know. D bitch, can we have one at a time? Like, goddamn, you know. Also, where's Sayori, you know? Come with her to a club, you know. Well, because this was... I was gonna say she had her session, right? But that was uh, the last day, right? You know. And again, yeah, he just immediately jumps to the worst case scenario, you know. I mean, just shoot her a text, right? Be like, hey, you coming to the club? Like, you don't need to, like, go look for her, right? Like, this, literally, you can just text her, right, you know. Yeah, it's like, to be fair, the MC literally did just fucking, you know, just, like, intrude on the girl's bathroom, you know. Dude, just fucking text her. Like, you're over... He's overthinking it. Just shoot her a text. Be like, you come to the club today? Like, question mark? Something like that, you know? Oh, yeah. Because, again, she didn't bring that up, right? Yeah, because, again, you know, it's been... And, yeah, because he is aware of it, right? Damn, she just went to town, you know. Oh, shit. Did she tell her? D hey, that's a W for Yuri, right? Like, it really takes some, like, curse to actually bring that up. Because, again, we, the, the question was, oh, is she going to bring – and funny enough, I think this is – once we get through this conversation, I'll probably end it. Because, again, the, the question and what we were wondering is, like, oh, is she going to bring it up during the meeting, right? You know, and it, that didn't happen. So, it's like – and to be fair, Natsuki, well – Sayori doesn't, but again, you know, probably not a good thing to say. And then, um, again, you know, Monica obviously knows already, right? So Natsuki is kind of the odd one out, but bring it up to her, you know. Yeah, and it's funny how, like, she didn't, but now most people know. Yeah, you know. Yeah, you know. But yeah, you know, that's the reality, right? Yeah. 
dude, literally just text. Like, I, I don't know why they didn't just text her, right? Oh, she's at the rooftop, right? Oh, yeah, she is there, so. Yeah, you know. Oh, well, she's there, you know. Yeah, what are you two yapping about? Like, oh, shit. I'm, I'm going to end it here, right? You know, it's like, what are you two yapping about? Oh, shit, fuck. That is, that's good on Yuri, though. Props to her, right? You know, but I guess obviously they're waiting. But that's why I'm like, you could literally just text her, right? He immediately just jumped to worst case scenario. It's like, dude, that's what you got to work on, bro. Yeah, and right, I think this is a good place to end it. We'll um end it here and possibly, again, continue, do a double for today, right, for us. But again, you know, we'll see, right? But with that, don't really got much else to say. So, yep, that's it for this one. See you in the next one.